For years, our community has been dealing with the scourge of opioids. We have taken some actions to help. Emergency anti-overdose solutions are now easy to find on police officers, firefighters, and other life service, so they aren't helpless when they encounter an overuse of drugs. Unfortunately, they're seeing more young lives put in jeopardy because of fentanyl. Earlier this month, a 15-year-old overdosed and died. It's one of eight recent overdose deaths in Montgomery County. The Montgomery County Fire Department has reported that an additional 38 people would have been killed since December if were not for the life-saving naloxone, also known as Narcan. Opioid misuse and overdoses has been a major public health problem in our county for several years. But more recently, the use of fentanyl and pills and the younger age of those misusing it is very concerning. Last year, youth overdoses in Montgomery County alone increased 77%. Fentanyl is a synthetic drug intended to mimic opioids, and it's pressed into pill form so it looks like many other drugs. Users taking the pills may not realize the danger they're putting themselves in. Nationally, 71% of adolescent overdose deaths in 2021 involve fentanyl. The more kids experiment with drugs, the greater the risk posed by the presence of fentanyl in the drug market. This Saturday at Clarksburg High School, MCPS is hosting a fentanyl awareness forum for families helping give them the tools for prevention and helping protect their children. It is free and will take place from 9.30 to 11.30 a.m. in the school cafeteria. This forum will also be live streamed on the MCPS homepage. Make it a priority to talk to your kids about dangers of drugs like fentanyl. Go to our website, knowtherisksmc.org, for information and resources.